good morning and happy Thursday to everyone out there. Um, I hope that you all are doing wonderful on this Thursday. Um, so tomorrow will be um, one week that I started the keto challenge, which is to lose 10 pounds in the month of August. Um, I did step on the scale on last Wednesday to weigh myself before I even got on the challenge. And that's when I decided to go um keto so having said that um i am headed to work i did weigh myself this morning i weighed myself on yesterday um the scale is going down quite nicely and i will of course weigh myself on tomorrow uh for you know the challenge and everything um i do have my lunch which i'm going to show you what I'm having today. So just hold on one second, I'll show you. Okay, guys, so that's what I have today, uh, some tuna lettuce wraps. And um, I'm gonna make some chicken today, some air fried chicken, I think. And I'm gonna try to make some cauliflower macaroni and cheese. Um, I have all the ingredients, so I'm gonna try that and see how that comes out. But I just want to come on and say just good morning to you guys to follow up. Let you know that um, the challenge is going good for me. Um, I am quite hungry now. I also am doing the intermittent fasting along with the keto where I only eat from, you know, eight hours during the daytime. But the hours that I choose and the hours that I like are from 12 noon until 8 p.m. That works out really good for me and my schedule. And yeah, so work's been super, super busy and um just taking it one day at a time guys being positive and trying to stay positive and just say good things and think good thoughts so more good things and more good thoughts will come to me um but when i stepped on the scale I, when i told you guys um on one of my videos that my weight was almost back up to where it was um uh, before you know years and years ago when i first started the challenge i think i was weighing um that's when i had got like a weight loss consultant and i think i was weighing in I was over 360 pounds. I was over 360 pounds. Um, and then when I got on the scale on last Wednesday, my weight was 358 point something pounds. So today I got on the scale, my weight was 349 point something. Um, tomorrow I have the exact, when I do my keto week, one week weight in or one week check in, I have the exact number but I'm down to 349. So um, I remember hearing Diamond Keto Diamond saying that um, how you know a lot of it's water weight and um, also that um, let's see um, that um, you know with keto you you get a lot a lot of the information it does come out your body. And I have noticed that with the swelling. Um, you know, my ankles and my feet has gone down tremendously. I can wear my shoes comfortably again because um, I was having some swelling with my feet and stuff during certain times of the day. Um, I do work a job where I sit down a lot during the day and so my feet were swelling a lot and then even with traveling also. Um, also, I noticed that my knee is not hurting as much. Uh, my left knee was used to be hurting me so, so bad. And I remember when I was on Weight Watchers, that our Weight Watchers leader, she did say that, you know, for every, is it every 10 pounds that you lose, or every five pounds, it's like 40 pounds of weight being being taken off your knees. So I have noticed that I feel, you know, a lot better. My, my knees and my legs feel a lot better. I'm able to get up better out of the bed. You know, it doesn't take me as long. I don't have to stand there for a moment and gather myself before I move. And then even when I move, I was, you know, so stiff. Um, I've also noticed that I do have a lot more energy, a lot more energy. I feel just so much better. My head feels a, a lot clearer. So it's just, um, it's better all the way around. You know, it's, it's, it's all positive. I did notice that I was having, I do have like a little dry mouth. Um, and then my, you know, my taste buds, I can feel them changing because they have changed. Um, and also I started last night, I was having like some kind of cramping in my stomach. Um, and I don't know if that's because of you know the salt or something i know they said you know, maybe lick some salt but get some sodium in you um i didn't do that i just wait you know i just waited outside i didn't know what the, what the cramps were but um i have 
um, drunk some of those um, instead of sodas. I've gotten some of those little ice drinks. They're like 50 cents or something like that at Walmart and Dollar General. They're flavored like sparkling waters, I guess, or sparkling sodas or whatever. It's zero calories, zero carbs. Um, it tasted okay. Um, but yeah, but eventually the cramps, they did go away and it felt like it might have been, you know, probably something related to um, something I'm not getting as far as like the food goes. So I may just look into, because I did have in my notes a suggestion for taking, there were two types of, you know, like, I guess, um, what is, is it like vitamins or pills or something that you can take, kind of make up for whatever it is that you're lacking in the food. So that's what, you know, I'm going to do. But anywho, um, enough of that, guys. So I'll be back later on when I get home this evening to show you what my, um, y'all already seen my air fried chicken, but I'm going to, I think I'm going to try, I think I'm going to try the cauliflower mac and cheese if I feel like it this afternoon and just have that. If not, I probably just have like the rice cauliflower and maybe put some cheese on because I have some in my freezer bag of it. But anyway, guys, I hope you all are doing good. I hope that you're motivated and inspired. Today is Thursday, and I'm back on regular schedule, so I have to be at work in five minutes. I should probably should be work should be at work right now at my desk because, but I have to be back at work at eight thirty. It's eight twenty five currently, um, and I'm probably about three or four minutes away. So, thank you all for tuning in. Uh, this is Thankful Thursday, and I'm so thankful. And you should be too if you're alive and breathing. So I am Pam with uh, Pam is winning. I am a winner and so are you. And I'll be back later on today to see how you check in with you guys. See how your days went. Okay, your Thursday went. Talk to you later. Okay, guys. So it's later. I'm back at home. And I'm going to show you what I cooked. So <clears throat> I fried some uh, chicken wings in my air fryer. And I made some bacon wrapped asparagus in the oven and I'm having um, some ranch dressing to dip my chicken in because I like it like that with that and I also like to have Frank's red hot sauce on there. Um, this ranch dressing right here is uh, one gram of carbs per serving and then to drink I'm having some of this right here zero calories zero carbs zero sugars and i got it in my dollar tree mug full of ice ice cold and i got my little wrench so that's what i'm having for dinner tonight um so yeah i'm going to parlez -vous, take me a nice hot bubble bath soak in it my day was it was a good day today and um tomorrow i expect it to be even better than today was so i hope that you all had a great day today and i will see you guys on to, if you're doing the uh, keto challenge or any kind of challenge please let, by all means let me know so we can encourage courage motivate and inspire one another on this journey that we're on together as a weight loss family and um you know we win honey we win so i will see you guys in the next vlog. Have a great rest of the evening.